<laughs> Hello. Okay. Terriers is a show that is shot right here in Ocean Beach. And this morning, uh, we are joined by two of the stars, Donald Logue and Michael Raymond James. So I guess first, let's take a look at the show so we can see what, it, what it's about. All right. Here's a piece of advice. Never play detective in your personal life. If she's uh, like that, she'll tell you. She is. Why hadn't she told me? She's a woman. All right. I'm going to head back. How you doing? You okay? All right. Well, I'm glad you took my advice and got out of town. Whatever you do, don't thank me. Okay, so what's going on in this clip? Uh, someone... Uh, yeah, my ex-wife is getting married, and he's about to... Yeah, well, have, someone spilled some wine on my shirt, and I, 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 I was at his ex-wife's wedding, and so he had to bring me up a new yeah, shirt. I only have for, one suit. I'm looking for any excuse to run by my ex-wife's <laughs> wedding, where I've been told by, <laughs> especially her, don't come by my wedding. So you're wedding. causing trouble. You're oh, the yeah. troublemaker in yeah. the show. Well, uh, well <laughs> we take turns. Yeah. Yeah. You take turns. So what, what is the show about? It's about two private investigators who are uh, live in San Diego, and they uncover this kind of big conspiracy that involves Ocean Beach. And, mm -hmm. you know, so it's, it's kind of, it's brought to you, uh, the guy that wrote Ocean's Eleven created the show okay. and did it with the guy, Sean Ryan, who created The Shield. So Ted Griffin and Sean Ryan. So fans of FX and Fox mm -hmm. know The Shield. And, um, you know, it's, it's, it's fairly dramatic but it has a little bit of it has a kind of humorous edge to it. Mm -hmm. You tell me a little bit more about your character. I play a guy who was a cop in San Diego who was fired and mm -hmm. uh, became a private investigator and I remembered this guy I had busted for having been a robber back in the day and I thought he'd have a good skill set to help me in my new enterprise mm -hmm. so we get together and we're partners and best friends and you know we kind of run amok throughout San Diego and we love it. Uh, it's you know, the first show in a long time that was set specifically in San Diego, not mm -hmm. just shot here, but it's about San Diego. Um, every reference is to Ocean Beach. Uh, and I'm actually from El Centro, so uh, I spent a lot of time throughout my life in San Diego. My mom lives here, my sister lives here, so it was kind of a treat for me to be, it's kind of like coming home a little bit. Are you down here a lot for shooting? Well, we were here, yeah, we did the whole season here, yeah, yeah, and then we're... we're, we're Kind of like your show, we, we, we shot it out a few months ago, and now okay. it's, it's kind of airing now. Oh, yeah. I see. So your character, you were the the bad guy who yeah. sort of kind of is going to be a good guy now? Bad guy with a heart of gold. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> exactly. Trying to go straight. So what is the story behind your character? Well, I was a former crook, and uh, one night trying to jimmy into a taco stand, you know, I get uh, uh, an offer to work with this dude who becomes sort of my best friend. and. Mm -hmm. What I like, too, is he's popped the question to his girl, and he met his girl because he had broken into her apartment. He saw her picture on the fridge. He was like, she's cute. I'm going to try and track her down. And try to steal her heart. I'll leave the TV and just steal her heart. So you, you're from the area, so you're familiar with Ocean Beach. What was yeah, it sort absolutely. of like filming there with, like, the locals, doing, like, interesting stories? You know, I think the locals were really cool. I have a real understanding that they like to protect this, what's special about Ocean Beach, mm -hmm. you know, but... I mean, what helped a lot was, uh, you know, we, we have about an army of 150 people that work on the show. All of them, except for nine people, are from San Diego. So mm -hmm. most, of, and a lot of the crew lived in Ocean Beach, and it was very, oh. you know, so it's not like, and maybe some people think like this, we take hundreds of people, bring them down from Los Angeles, plant them in San Diego, mm -hmm. and leave. It's like, these are all people from San Diego, and their kids are going to school in San Diego. And, and so it's, it's much more of a homegrown um, you know, it's much more of an organically San Diego-based project, and, and it was good for the community, and the people were cool. And the thing is, you just have to be respectful of them, mm -hmm. you know, and, and because it's invasive. But at the same time, I think it's always fun to watch, um, you know, uh, it's to watch your community on television and to follow along. Right. And, 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 you know, San Diego is such an amazing world-class city that it deserves, it deserves representation in film and television. You know, it's... it's it's an amazing place, so we, we were really, there's no better place to have to come and do a job, I'll tell you, like, I, I we were living agree. on Mission Beach, it was pretty, it was, I was like, I can't believe uh, we're renting a house on Mission Beach because I'm working in San Diego, yeah. like, it's, it, it's kind of like a dream come true. Well, that's great, it's going to be really fun for all of us to watch because it's right here in our backyard, yeah. so you guys can check out Terriers every Wednesday night at 10 p.m. on FX, and uh, hope you check it out. Back to you, Erica. Thanks so much, guys. That would be so dangerous for me. I'd be at Hodad's like four times a week <laughs> eating a burger. Yeah. Did you guys have a favorite restaurant that you would frequent? Quite uh, a few, actually. Yeah, yeah, quite a few. I'd have to say the Mission. The Mission on uh, Mission, yeah. Mission Boulevard. Mission Boulevard was like kind of like really close to home, and 
Yeah, a lot of places down by PB, I'd, I'd say it was kind of like where we the went The sneak joint, mm -hmm. you know, Very good. yeah. Nick's. Yeah. Good taste, you guys. Yeah, so. <laughs> Thanks so much for that. Well, Comic-Con fans will have another chance to score tickets to the popular...